Hey everybody, welcome back. This week what we're going to do is we're going to look at uh, fire alarm notification appliances in exit stair enclosures. Uh, this was prompted by a recent plan review I conducted of a high-rise building here in Orange Beach. And uh, I noticed that notification appliances were added in the exit stair enclosures. And I remembered reading in NFPA 72 when I was studying for NYSET um, that they did not want them there and the reasoning why. When looking at fire alarm notification appliances, should these be installed in exit stair enclosures? That's an interesting one and one that there in the past has not been a clear answer to, especially if you look specifically at the International Fire Code. So let's look at this a little bit more in depth and try to draw our own conclusions. The International Fire Code has historically been unclear uh, when it comes to notification appliances and exit stair enclosures. They have for quite some time exempted visual notification appliances. However, there's been no mention of exempting audible notification appliances. So it has been assumed that these are required in these locations. So most designers place them in the exit stair enclosure. Now let's take a look at NFPA 72, the 2013 edition. According to 23.8.6.2, notification appliances shall not be required in exit stair enclosures. This says notification appliances, so that means visual or audible. Uh, it's saying neither are required, and we'll read on into the annex so that we can get a better understanding of that. According to the annex, the general purpose of the fire alarm audible and visual notification appliances is to alert occupants that there is a fire condition and for occupants to exit from the building. Once the occupants are in the exit enclosures, high noise levels and light intensity from notification appliances could cause confusion and impede egress. What I've done is put together five reasons to avoid fire alarm notification appliances and exit stair enclosures. Number one, speakers in, in stair enclosures lack intelligibility, meaning that they're difficult to understand. The audible signaling and light reflection can impede egress or cause confusion as detailed in NFPA 72. Number three, these areas are used at times as areas of refuge. Therefore, two-way communication is critical. Number four, this is a critical area needed for emergency communications. Firemen are moving into place up this exit stair enclosure and they need to be able to communicate with command and other in their party. And five, stair enclosures are typically unconditioned and typically uh, condensation causes problems with the fire alarm system. So what are your thoughts? Do you believe in my interpretation that notification appliances should not be installed at all in exit stair enclosures? Or do you, do you believe differently? I'd love to know your thoughts. Uh, thank you for joining me this week and I look forward to uh, coming back with uh, a different topic next week.